Chapter One: The Evil Magician. A long time ago, there lived a lazy boy named Aladdin. He would play with his friends all day long. Aladdin's mother was upset about her son. She would cry and pray. She wanted her son to change his behavior. However, Aladdin never changed. One day, a man came to Aladdin and asked, "Are you Mustafa's son?" "I am," answered Aladdin. "But he died long ago." The stranger kissed Aladdin when he heard this. He said, "I am your uncle. I thought you might look like my brother." Go home and tell your mother that I am coming. Aladdin ran home and told his mother. Yes, your father had a brother. His mother said, "But I thought he was dead." She prepared some food. His uncle came to their house. He spoke to Aladdin's mother. Please don't be surprised. You don't know me. I was living in another country for forty years. Aladdin took him all around the city. They looked at all of the sights together. His uncle bought Aladdin some beautiful clothes. Aladdin, I have something to tell you," said the uncle. "I'm your uncle, but I'm also a magician." Aladdin was excited to hear this. The next day, the magician took Aladdin to a valley between two big mountains. "I will show you something fantastic," said his uncle. The magician said the magic word, "Abracadabra." The earth shook in front of them. Magically, a brass ring appeared. Under the brass ring is a treasure. It will be yours. But you must do exactly what I tell you. When Aladdin heard the word treasure, he was no longer afraid. Pick up the ring," said the magician. "Now say the name of your father." Aladdin did as he was told. The ring opened a door. Some steps appeared. "Go down into the cave," said the magician. "There you will see a lamp." Pick it up and bring it to me. Aladdin went down into the cave. He found a lamp in a garden. He picked it up and took it to the entrance of the cave. Hurry, give me the lamp! Shouted the magician. I will give it to you when I'm out of the cave, replied Aladdin. The magician became very angry. He said some magic words. The door closed. The man wasn't really Aladdin's uncle. He was an evil magician. He picked Aladdin to use him. He planned to kill Aladdin after he got the lamp. Aladdin stayed in the dark cave for two days. He rubbed his hands together to pray. While rubbing, he also rubbed the brass ring. A big genie appeared. I'm the genie of the ring. I will grant all your wishes," said the genie. "Please get me out of this cave," said Aladdin. The earth opened, and magically, Aladdin was outside. Aladdin was so happy to be outside. He ran home as fast as he could. He told his mother what happened. Aladdin showed her the lamp. Now he was hungry, but there was no food. I'll sell this lamp and buy some food," he said. The lamp was very dirty. Aladdin's mother began to clean it. She rubbed the dirt off, and another genie appeared out of the lamp. "What would you like?" said the genie. 
Aladdin's mother was so surprised that she fainted. Aladdin grabbed the lamp. Bring me something to eat, he demanded. The genie returned with twelve silver plates filled with meat. Please sell the lamp, his mother begged. This genie is a devil. No, I can't, said Aladdin. We should keep this lamp. We will need it.